Hey guys, welcome to my new video. In this video, I will show how to make wall circle animation with using Duke Angel in After Effects. Let's get started. So guys, welcome back and first one, select this foot layer, select this foot 1, 2 and 3. This is left foot and let's go to solo, press T, open opacity and change opacity like this. Let's change 50 and let's zoom in here right now let's click this empty area for unselect and go to pen tool and let's make lines for bones let's make like this this is first bone and this is next bone and this is last bone okay so don't click section tool go to window and open duik angela okay so select this duik and let's put here and let's click these bones and go to humanite and select this ledge okay select this bone this is bone one let's change name one and this two and this three and right now select this foot one let's link to bone one select this foot two link to bone two and select this foot three link to bone 3 so right now select this bone 1 2 3 and this bone and go to duke angel again click auto rig okay so select this controller let's see okay so for fix this problem let's go to site and change minus 100 percent and let's select this controller again okay that's good so let's select this controller go to icon and move to right this controller or move to left okay that's good so select this foot one two three change opacity 100 percent and let's unsolo and this bones also on solo okay let's see again okay very nice so let's make some ways for other foot let's close this opacity and select this again foot one two three and go to solo and let's press t change opacity 50 and let's click this icon for c background and go to pen tool let's make again bones like this okay don't click section tool go to humanite again ledge and change names this is one two and three so right now let's select this foot one link to bone one select foot 2 link to bone 2 and foot 3 link to bone 3 and right now select these all bones and go to click auto rig okay so let's see okay so let's again change side minus 100 percent nice and go to icon and move to left and select these foot layers change opacity 100 percent and close settings and unsolo and this unsolo so right now i will keep only controllers and let's click toggle switch mode and we can see here this icon right now we can click here hide for all layers nice and select these bones also click this icon for hide bones and also this this let's see this is let's change name foot left and this controller foot right 
and select these other bones, click this second for height and this click for height, also select these bones, height. So right now we have two controllers, only foot layers. Okay, so in this time select this body down and go to solo, go to pen behind, move the anchor point down a little bit, utilization tool and unsolo, select this body, go to solo and go to pen behind again, move the anchor point down, utilization tool, unsolo and select body link to body down and select body down, press air, let's see nice and select this hand left hand right link to body layer select body down press air let's say again okay very nice and select these eyes link to heat select heat link to body and let's say again select this body down press air chain rotation okay very nice okay so in this time let's select these I can for show hidden layers and select these bones, bone one and this bone one. Let's link to body down. Again, click this icon for height and select these body down. Let's see. Nice, very good. So right now we can make walk cycle animation. So first one, select this body down. Press P. Make new passing keyframe and go to 6 keyframes. Let's click time duration right here, plus 6. Click OK. And let's move it down with the bit. Let's see. OK, go to again 6 keyframes. For go to frame by frame, use page down in keyboard. Let's go to 6 keyframes. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. And select this first keyframe, copy pass. Say keyframes make easy. And for loop animation, hold Alt, click time icon, go to play button, property and loop out duration. For down expression, click this empty area. Let's see. Okay. So in this time, let's select these foot layers and press P, make new passing keyframe and select this foot left. Let's move to left like this and foot right, move to right. And let's go to 10 keyframes. For shotgun, you can use hold shift, press page down and make new keyframes. And again, go to 10 keyframes. Select first keyframes, copy pass. Okay, so right now let's go to middle and select this controller. And I want to use valley. Let's go to first second, select this right foot, and I will copy this. Let's control C and go to here. Select this controller and let's click here. Control V. Click enter. Nice. And go to first second. Let's copy this. Control C and select this controller. Go to middle and select G frame. Edit here, Control V for pass. Let's see. Okay. And right now, select this foot left and go to middle and move to up for step animation. Let's see. Nice. And go to here, select this middle and move to up again for step animation. And let's press N for select work area. Let's do full animation. Okay, nice. And select two frames, make easy or click F9. Okay, not bad. And right now, go to here. And let's hold Shift, press R, open rotation. And go to here. Make new rotation keyframe. Go to middle keyframe, let's zoom in here and chain rotation like this. And here change again, rotation zero. Say keyframes make easy. Let's see. Nice, and we can select this middle keyframe, move to up. 
Nice, and let's change rotation. Okay, not bad. So right now go to here, select this, and hold shift, press air, open rotation, make rotation keyframe, and go to middle, change rotation, and go to here, change zero. Make keyframes easy. And go to middle keyframe and move to up more. Okay, not bad. So right now select these two frames, let's copy, go to here, control V, and here control V for loop animation. And right now let's select work area, let's press N. Okay, and right mouse, select here, and select two frames for left foot, copy. And go to next shift frame, control V for paste. Let's see. Nice, very good. So in this time, let's make and animate other elements. Select this hand left layer and go to pen behind. Move the anchor point up. Clization tool. And hand right. Also go to solo. And... Move the anchor point up here. Clusation tool and unsolo. Select hand left. And press air open rotation and hand right press air open rotation. Make first two frames. And select hand left, change rotation like this. And hand right, change to back. And select this hand right, let's Move to behind foot layers. Okay, and go to 10 Q frames. Change rotation like this. And hand left. Move to back. Go to again 10 Q frames. Select first Q frames. Copy pass. And press N. Let's say animation. Okay, select Q frames. Make easies. Not bad, and let's use expression. Hold Alt, click this hand left time icon, and go to play button, property loop iteration. Nice, and let's close settings, and let's make some way for this hand right. Hold Alt, click time icon, play button, property, and loop iteration. Okay, nice. And select this hit. Let's go to solo. And go to pen behind. Move the anchor point down. And let's unsolo. Let's move to here. Clusation tool. And press air. Open rotation. Make rotation keyframe. And go to here. Let's chain rotation like this. Go to some keyframes. Chain rotation. Let's select first keyframe. Copy pass. And select two frames, make easy. Also, let's use expression. Hold Alt, click time icon, play button, prepare to end loop alteration. Nice. And select these eyes, press S, click this icon, and make scale two frames. And here, make new scale two frame. Go to three two frames. For go to frame by frame two frames. You can press page down each keyboard. 1 to 3. Change scale 5%. Got 3 two frames. 1 to 3. Change 100%. Let's see. Nice. Select two frames. Make easy. And let's copy two frames. And go to here. Control V for random eye blink animation. Let's see. Nice. So, guys, finally, let's select this body layer. And let's press air open rotation, make rotation two frame, chain rotation two, and go to 10 two frames and change minus two. Again, go to 10 two frames, select first two frame, copy pass, and make two frames easy. And let's hold alt, go to time icon, go to play button, prepare to end loop alteration. So let's see. 
Okay, this is more realistic. Also, we can select these two frames, hold Alt, move to left for random dynamic animation. Let's see. Nice, very good. So guys, thank you for watching my video and don't forget to subscribe to the channel, like video and please follow me on Instagram. Good luck!